Welcome to Global Marine Systems Subsea Training Facility. The Subsea Training Facility, based in Portland Port, Dorset, on the southwest coast of England, is a world leader in training and certification for remotely operated vehicles known as ROVs and comprises of a large training area which contains both work class and inspection class ROVs. The training school set up in 2005 has over the last five years seen 300 candidates successfully complete the available courses. Global Marine Systems set up the Subsea Training School in Portland initially to train our own subsea operational staff. Subsequent to that we opened up the courses to staff from other offshore companies and to individuals looking to work in the offshore industry. What sets Global Marine Systems Subsea Training School apart from other training schools is that Global Marine Systems is an offshore operator with an international fleet of 15 vessels and over 20 work-class submersibles. This allows students access to a wide array of offshore operational equipment such as work-class ROVs, inspection-class ROVs, heavy-duty umbilicals and winches, ROV launch and recovery systems, subsea ploughs and trenching ROVs, as well as a wide range of tooling and components used offshore. The Subsea Training School offers IMCA-aligned ROV training courses, which provides a certificate of competency for people employed in the offshore industry, as well as new entrants into the industry. The ROV course is an IMCA-aligned course and all students should have a relevant technical background within mechanics, hydraulics, electrics or electronics. This background will assist the students during the course and when the time comes to gain future employment. The three-week course is designed to provide students with the knowledge and new skills required to work towards achieving an ROV Pilot Technician 1 status. The course is designed to teach safety, teamwork and seamanship with the main emphasis on practical hands-on ROV experience. The three-week course comprises of the following. Week one begins in the classroom where the students are taught offshore safety, following IMCA guidelines, as well as mechanics, electrics and hydraulics. Weeks two and three are all practical units. These are workshop practicals, cable splicing, fibre optic termination and fibre optic fused splicing. Umbilical electrical retermination. Camera maintenance and repair. Umbilical mechanical termination. Solenoid valves. Compensator maintenance. ROV piloting in Portland Harbor. Arbor wall inspection, pier leg inspection, hull inspection, umbilical management, underwater navigation using sonar, marker buoy placement. The subsea training school also houses a work class ROV simulator. The ROV simulator has two ROVs on the system to allow students to spend as much time as they require simulating offshore seabed operations on oil and gas structures specific defence tasks based around submarine operations, as well as manipulator tasks, such as object recovery. There are normally six to eight students on the course, giving a maximum four students to one tutor on any given course. Bespoke subsea training courses are also available based on client-specific requirements. Skilled staff at the subsea training facility have the ability to adapt current courses to suit your needs. The Subsea Training School has an exciting future ahead, with expansion of courses based on the requirement of Global Marine Systems Fleet. These courses will be available to competitor companies, as well as anyone wishing to enter the subsea industry. The majority of the students that lead the Subsea Training course are successful in gaining employment within the subsea industry. For further information on our courses, please contact Leslie White.